Hey folks. So I didn't do a, an intro talk this time because I was in a hurry to get out. I got to bed really, really late last night. I should say this morning. And I got woke up by the scanner. So I just kind of, I turned off my first two alarms <laughs> to wake up a little later. And, well, I got up really late. So it was 4.30 by the time I got out here. And I had a couple things waiting for me at the post office, so I had to get just get out really quick. Get those before I did anything else. I just went for a quick tour. Grabbed my coffee, sat at the river for a bit, and come home. So, got my glasses already. It surprised me. Ow, good for the fingernails. These things are always the same. They come with this really big carrying case that I never use. And it's got different colored lenses, which I never use. It's got the brown, it's got the yellow, it's got the clear, which is kind of pointless. And it comes with its own screwdriver to change the lenses. The ones I use are always pre-installed, which is cool because I don't have to change anything. Comes with charging cable, lens cleaning cloth, and a user manual. And there they be, my nice new glasses. Surprise me already. see they've got the the ear protectors little foam pads on them <coughs> excuse me so, these are the first thing that breaks like the seams coming apart on this one already so it's not going to be long before it comes off so I'm going to turn it on and it comes on Or at least I know they sort of work because the light came on when I tried to turn them on. So I'll try them out later. Uh, they'll probably be in Chinese as soon as I turn them on. I'll have to switch to English. And then I'll see if they'll connect to my phone and then everything is good. The other thing I got, give me a second to untangle the cord here. is a solution to my dark face, I hope. So I got me a ring light. It's got a clamp. So just cl I'm gonna clamp it onto the edge of the workbench here. I have one of these on my computer. I, don't, I normally don't use my room light. I just, I have a, I light up the desk in front of my computer and that provides all the light that I need. Problem is this, flexible tube here isn't strong enough to hold its own weight so it, it's hard to keep it in one spot this one feels a lot better it's a whole lot stiffer I can hold it out directly sideways and it doesn't sag so that's good considering it's even longer than the one I had plus it also comes with a phone holder <laughs> so if I clamp it onto the desk here That if I bring the phone holder up, okay, it kind of moved a little bit. It looks like it's going to stay in place, and you can't see either of them, so that's cool. Another USB. So I am going to unplug my microphone charger cable here because I'm running out of. If I can, I'll make out that stuff. Out of USB ports. Plug this in. See if I can figure this out. Okay, that's on and off.
<laughs> Trying to figure out which one's best. Should I add some maps or not? Okay, that's maximum brightness. That's not very bright at all. If I can bring it closer. That looks better. Without my glasses, I'm not going to get a glare. And the nice thing about the phone holder is if I need to read my notes that I leave myself, I no longer have to hold the phone. Phone's too much for it. <laughs> it's gradually sinking. <laughs> yeah, this one's not going to be very strong. So I wonder if I can hold it up like that. No. Okay, that one's not going to be strong enough. That's a disappointment. It does come with a ball mount, which is kind of cool. But it's not going to stay up. Dang it. Should I move it back further? Oh, it's a little better. Oh, that's much better. So now, when I have notes in my phone to read, I don't have to hold my phone and I don't have to look down like this. It's, it's like sinking. It's still sinking. <laughs> Going down. Okay. That's funny. Boink. And it's now on the desk. I'm gonna grab my other camera. <sighs> okay, I'll just kind of show you what I'm looking at here. <laughs> So there's the light. I just got a lot of crap on my desk here. I got to clean off. I just got it clamped to the edge of the bench there. And here's my phone holder upper. I put it where I want it, and it's just, it's just not gonna stay. It gradually sinks. <laughs> So I'm thinking, once I get my desk cleaned off here, then I'll just, I'll put it right down on the surface itself and see if I can find a place that's oh, it's actually going to stay. See, that works right there. And that's where I had it. I thought that would be perfect. Because then I can read it and everything's good. But then it just gradually started sinking down again. But that actually looks like it's going to stay. So, I don't know. I'll work something out. Figure it out one way or another. So all those two items I got today, and I'm hoping this light will be good enough. It's not as bright as I expected it to be. It's not bright at all. But hopefully it's good enough to light up my face and not cause a problem. I guess we'll have to see, right? I'm kind of limited to where I can actually clamp it. Because it, wherever it is, I have to keep it out of view of the camera itself. I could put it up in front of the camera so that the, the ring is actually right at the lens. So the lens is in the middle of the ring. But then it's kind of too far away because like I say it, it's not very bright. It does have bright adjustments but that's, that's maximum right there. I can turn it down. <laughs> Can't turn it up. Um. So, 25 degrees today. Kind of nice. Uh, sun's not out. It's overcast. There is a whole lot of rain out there that's coming our way. It looks like, 
and I wasn't sure if I was going to get caught in any or not because there's there's blotches that are like right around us. I, I felt a couple raindrops um, after I came down the hill, I think. Where was it? I think it started right after the, the school trail. Get rid of that glare. After I come out of the school trail, I start going up the hill. I think that's when I started feeling them. And from there to Timmy's, I got the odd raindrop. Just enough to feel it. And that, that's it. That's all I got the whole time out. I was kind of hoping nothing would happen because, like I say, I didn't have time to prepare. I just I had to get out. So I didn't have time to wrap anything in plastic. And then I ran both, both cameras today. Just in case I had to cover up the open one. <laughs> So, oh, I hope this works. I don't remember how much I paid for it. I'll stick it up on the screen. And my glasses. I'll put links to them. Links to them both in the description. There's, people tend to ask me about links when I don't include them. So, I just kind of always include them now when I can. When there's actually a link to include. <laughs> So I guess that's all I got for today. I don't remember anything else to say. Um, I'm hoping my video is going to be up in time. Uh, the last one I talked about, number 63 in a row. <laughs> I'm having a problem rendering that. I woke up today. Or no, I, I started rendering it a while before I went to bed and I was doing something else and I think when the scanner woke me up I noticed it was only about half done so I checked and sure enough program crashed so the rendering failed and I started it again and then when I woke up today once again it had crashed so I'm doing half of it now and hopefully when I get in that half will be done <laughs> and then I'll get the other half done because I gotta get it up before tomorrow's video yeah, tomorrow's video is the last one that's on YouTube, which would be the last video you see before this one. It's confusing when I talk about that. Because <laughs> to me, I got today's video and then tomorrow's video, which is the video before this one. <laughs> well, and then I got this one. Ah, this one's not going to be all that long anyways. I just got a short tour and then this 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 part here is pretty quick to, to process, so... Anyway, I guess that's all I got. And hopefully that part was successful. And then I'll render the other half and then stitch the two together, which takes like minimal time. And then I'm ready to upload. So, that's all I got. I'm going to play with this a little bit before I go in and, and see what I can get done. So hopefully my face is bright enough now. It's, it's not going to cause a problem for anything. So, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys.